in today's episode you will learn how to use the DS18B20 waterproof temperature sensor with the Node MCU ESP8266 Wi-Fi module and display the temperature on gauges using the Blink application. This is an IoT Internet of Things based project. With the help of Node MCU ESP8266 Wi-Fi module and Blink application, the temperature can be monitored from anywhere around the world. This is version 2 of the DS18B20 waterproof temperature sensor monitoring system while in version 1 I used the same temperature sensor with the Arduino and displayed the temperature value on a 16 into 2 LCD. I will provide a link in the description if in case you want to watch this tutorial. In today's episode we will cover number 1 DS18B20 introduction number 2 complete circuit diagram number 3 interfacing number 4 blink application designing and finally number 5 testing without any further delay let's get started the components and tools used in this project can be purchased from Amazon the components purchase links are given in the description one wire temperature sensor like the DS18B20 or devices that can measure temperature with a minimal amount of hardware and wiring these sensors use a digital protocol to send accurate temperature readings directly to your development board without the need of an analog to digital converter or other extra hardware you can get one wire sensors and different form factors like waterproof and high temperature props. These are perfect for sensing temperature and many different projects and applications. And since these sensors use the one wire protocol, you can even have multiple of them connected to the same pin and read all their temperature values independently. The DS18B20 waterproof temperature sensor has three wires. The red wire is the VCC wire. The operating voltage is 3 to 5 volts. In my case, I'll be using 3.3 volts from the Node MCU ESP8266 Wi Fi board. Yellow wire is the data wire. We usually connect a resistor between the data wire and VCC wire. I will explain this in the circuit diagram. The black wire is the ground wire. This wire is connected with the Node MCU ESP8266 Wi Fi module ground. This temperature sensor is capable of measuring the temperature ranging from minus 55C to 125C. This is the complete circuit diagram of the Node MCU ESP8266 DS18B20 waterproof temperature sensor monitoring system. This schematic is designed in Gatesoft Eagle. 9.1.0 version. If you want to learn how to make a schematic and PCB, then watch my tutorial. The link is given in the description. Let's first of all start with the 5 volt regulated power supply, which is used to power up the Node MCU ESP8266 Wi Fi module. This power supply is based on the famous LM7805 voltage regulator. J1 is a female power jig and this is where we connect a 12 volt adopter, battery or a solar panel. Two 470 microfarad capacitors are connected at the input and output sides of the voltage regulator. A 330 ohm resistor is connected in series with a 2.5 volt LED. This is a current limiting resistor. The output of the voltage regulator is connected with a VN pin of the Node MCU ESP8266 Wi-Fi module and the ground is connected with the ground. SV1 and SV2 are the female headers. As you can see a 4.7 kilo ohm resistor is connected between the VCC and data wire. You can also use a 10k resistor. The VCC is connected with 3.3 volts. The ground is connected with the Node MCU ESP8266 module ground, while the data wire is connected with the digital pin D4 of the Node MCU ESP8266 Wi Fi module. This is the final circuit board. The PCB board file and schematic can be downloaded from my website. 
As you can see, the red wire, which is the VCC wire, is connected with the 3.3 volts. The ground wire of the DS18B20 temperature sensor is connected with the Node MCU module ground. While the yellow wire, which is the data wire, is connected with the digital pin D4 of the Node MCU module. First of all, open the Blink application. Set the project name is DS18B20. Click on the Choose Device and select Node MCU. Make sure you set the connection type to Wi-Fi. Then click on the Create button. An authentication token will be sent on your email ID, which will be then used in the programming. Simply copy and paste it in the programming. Now click on the screen and search for the gauge and edit. Now again click on the screen and add another gauge and follow the same exact steps. Our application is ready and now let's discuss the programming. Before you start the programming, first of all make sure that you download all the necessary libraries and also make sure you update the Node MCU board. I will provide a link in the description. This is the authentication token which was sent via email. This is the name of the Wi-Fi router and this is the password. The data wire of the DS18B20 is connected with the digital pen D4 of the Node MCU module. Maximum of these instructions are already explained in my previous IoT based projects. Gate send data is a user defined function and is executed every one second. Then starts the while loop function, which consists of only two functions timer.run and blink.run. Get send data is a user defined function. It has no return type and it does not take any arguments as the input. The purpose of this function is to read the temperature and then send the temperature values in Celsius and Fahrenheit to the Blink application using virtual pins V3 and V4. The circuit diagram, PCB board file, and programming can be downloaded from our website. The link is given in the description. I have already uploaded this program. Let's watch this project in action. Support me on Patreon for more videos. I hope you liked today's episode. Like and share this video with your friends. See you in next episode and thanks for watching.